airdrop on them. Fuck the airdrop. <laughs> I'm trying to drop my pennies for my man. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome to another vlog. So this is gonna be the beginning of this vlog. Um, on my last vlog, I did leave out that I have COVID. So it's Sunday, Easter Sunday. Happy Easter. I hope you guys are enjoying the holiday. As for me, I have to continue to quarantine. And y'all know how I feel about holidays and Sundays. It's supposed to be spent with your loved ones, but unfortunately i'm the one with covid so i have to stay at home and not go around anybody so my mama did just drop me out some food she ended up barbecuing you know she cooked every sunday and every holiday so i'm gonna show you what i have i am currently washing my sheets in the background so if you hear some noise that's what that is so i have ribs hot dogs chicken potato salad, spaghetti, baked beans, hot dog buns, I have a ginger ale, and then a lemonade. So, so yeah, I'm just about to eat this food, y'all, but I haven't been doing anything but watching TV, taking medicine, trying to get myself all the way together showering sleeping that's it so i'll talk to y'all probably later on Hey y'all, so it's the next day and I'm feeling way better, like way better. I don't feel like um, I'm lightheaded or anything like that. So I've been running out of household things. So I did run to the store and I got a couple of things. So I'm going to show y'all what I have. And then that's pretty much it. So I have some candles. disinfecting wipes because COVID's still around somehow disinfecting spray I got some odor booster some sheets some detergent body wash another body wash Two air fresheners, some Dove soap, some more Dove soap, and some tissue. So that's all that I have from the store. I'm about to put this stuff up and then lay down because. I can't be doing too much now. I'm just now feeling better. So, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Good morning, y'all. So, it's been two days since I picked up the camera. And I'm actually feeling much better. I feel like every day I've been feeling better and better. So, today I feel like I might be at like a 80 to 90%. So I'm about to go and get retested to make sure I don't have COVID.
But y'all know what so crazy. So the first time I had COVID was three years ago around this same time, same holiday and everything. So for me to have it three years later, I'm trying to figure out what is God trying to tell me, all right? I know it's something, but I really don't know. Maybe he want me to quit my job right now. But I am, so. But yeah, <laughs> the first time I had it, I couldn't taste, smell, and I was feeling congested. This time, um, I was just congested. Oh yeah, that time I had that real too. This time, that real congested. Um, my body, I had body aches. My body was hot. I had um, body chills. It was just way worse. And what's crazy is I had been vaccinated or whatever. And it's like, here it is, I didn't get vaccinated. And then what was the purpose? You know, like, I don't understand. But I know one thing, I ain't getting vaccinated again. And I'm not fucking getting a booster and shit else they have to offer. So I just got up here to this place because it's 15 minute COVID testing. So we'll see if I got it. So why are I saying they closed? Why fucking tell y'all open? Say like seven days a week, 8.30 to 5.30, it's now 45. What? Yeah, yeah. But yeah, um, I don't know. So now I gotta find another fucking place that can do a COVID testing like really fast. I don't mean like fast. I just wanted to make sure I don't have COVID anymore because I need to go to my mom's house. And she was the one that was saying like, because I had told her I was gonna, what she suggested for me to come back yesterday and she asked like oh are you um covid free <laughs> and i'm just like girl what like no i don't know like no i didn't go and check she's like oh well you need to <laughs> check before you come over here so i'm trying to do that and then also i need to go get me a car wash we're gonna go to the grocery store I'm so mad that I'm about to be spending cash up on groceries again. Again, like, those little two months that I was buying a little link, it was cool. But let me get my shit together. I'll talk to y'all in a second. Hey, y'all. So, it is later on in the day. I wasn't able to go <laughs> and take a test. So, I do have an at-home test I'm going to take when I get home. But... Just got me some food. Y'all know I'm a, I'm a always eat. I'm about to, <laughs> I'm about to go on a little detox for real. Cause this up here, mm -mm. but everything else, body snatch, still. But I'm about to eat this food and then I'm about to study. I'm right here at the park by my house. So that's the mood for right now. I got me some chicken tenders and then some cheese fries from um, Priscilla's. So yeah, the sun is going down, unfortunately. So I'm about to read at least one chapter. I do have my notebooks so I can take notes as well, but I think I'm going to take the notes at home because I need to try to like get through the chapter and then I can go back through the chapter and write down like the key terms. So that's what I'll be doing. Hey y'all, so it's the next day. I just got dressed to go to brunch. Well, not even brunch, to go to lunch. I'm going to show y'all what I got on. But let Carisha know that I'm on her ass. And she ain't the only one. Snatch. That's why I'm on her ass. Like, come on now. Like, quit playing with me. 
snatched okay but anyway new balance little one piece crop top um hoodie see y'all in a second So I'm back in my car. I'm on my way to the mile. I'm gonna go to New York Town Mile and see if they have some white ones. And then I'm gonna go to the grocery store. I might go household, not household shopping, but like, yeah, household shopping to get like a couple of house items that um, I need, like some house decor. I might go house decor shopping, let me say that. So, I'm going to take y'all along the way, yeah. 21, can you do something for me? Can you hit a little rich flex for me? Then 21, can you do something for me? Drop some bars to my pussy ex for me. Then 21, can you do something for me? Can you talk to the ops next for me? 21, do your thing, 21, do your thing. Thing, Yellow diamonds in the watch. This shit costs a lot. Never send a die. That's how you get shot. I DM in vanish mode. I do that shit a lot. Took the panties off and this thicker than the plot. All my S's ain't nothing. Them hoes busted. If my ops ain't rapping, they ass fucking. You ain't ready to pull the trigger. Don't clutch it. I know you on your fear, baby. Can you suck it? I'm a savage. Smacker, booty, and magic. I slap a nigga with the ratchets. I might slap a track on this roof and get the hat. Don't call me on Christmas Eve. Call your dad. Call your uncle. Don't call me. Always in my ear, your whole fleet. Why my ass be posting guns and only use their feet? Hey, like an athlete, I got. All you hoes, all of you hoes, need to remember who. I'm talking to it's a slaughter gang CEO. I got it for you if I'm not working, girl. If I'm busy, to no, you need to find you someone else to call when you make it. Can I get low? You need to find you someone. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. So it's the next day, and I'm on my way to run my errands that I didn't do yesterday. First stop, I'm gonna fill up my gas, and then I'm gonna go to Target. I need to just get a couple of items, but I'm also gonna see what they have in there. And then I'm going to go to the grocery store. I plan on cooking for the next two days because I'm tired of eating the same food. And um, I'm tired of really going out to eat, honestly. And I'm tired of fucking drinking. But like I said before, if I'm going out, I'm going to have a drink. Period. So yeah, yesterday I ended up going to the mall. I didn't see nothing up in H&M. I wasn't trying to get nothing out of Forever 21. I just parked my car right there so I can get inside of the mall. So that's why I went in there. But they didn't have anything either. And then Home Goods, baby, look, I hate going to places and it's cluttered. It was cluttered and it was just too much going on. So I didn't even get anything up out of there. I'm gonna go to another Home Goods. Um, and see what they have because I hate shopping like why putting out the new inventory it just be a little too much and it don't be enough fucking space enough for all these people at one time that's probably why I keep catching COVID because I keep going to congested ass places so that's that and then after I end up leaving the mall I did go 
home I lay down for a couple of hours and then me and my bestie had like a little date night so I got back up and went to Brick that's the name of the bar we went to food was good drinks was good vibe was amazing like that was my first time but that's gonna be my little spot so I'll talk to y'all later I said, skirt all niggas, skirt up all niggas, skirt down, you acting like me, acting like we was more than a summer flag. I said, farewell, you took it well. Promise I won't cry, but spill milk. Me a paper tower, give me another value, give me another hour or two. I'll walk with you. Why you bother me when you know you don't want me? Yeah. Why you bother me when you know you got a woman? Yeah. Why you hear me when you know you know better? Know you know better. Know you grew better than you do. Call me looking for you. Yeah. I'll be looking for you. Yeah. Got me look hey y'all, so I'm back at home. I'm tired. I'm telling you, trying to go and run and do errands, it's a lot. I didn't go to Target. I'm going to go a little later because that grocery store just wooed me the fuck out. I had to go up and down the stairs three times and I still got a case of water in the trunk. So I'm going to just show you all what I have. I'm not going to do like a haul one by one. I'm just going to show you all what I got, put my um, groceries up. I'm gonna make me something to eat and then I'm going to study for a little while, take a nap, and then when I get up from the nap, I talk back to y'all. Yeah, so that's all that I have. I'm telling y'all, that little two months, uh, that link that I had, baby, look, I need some more of it because I just spent 140 on just that, that little stuff. And I need to give me some more stuff, but I told myself that I was going to only get stuff that I'm going to make within the next couple of days because I tend to buy stuff and then I let it expire and never end up um, cooking it or using it. And I just need to stop doing that because as long as I'm spending cash on stuff, I have no food to be wasting, throwing in the garbage or none of that. So, I'm about to put this stuff up. And um, I'll talk to y'all in a second. Hello, stranger. It's been a minute since we last kicked by the way, just got in town And I won't let cumulus clouds all in the sky Ruin my vibe Usually I don't do this often But since recruiting isn't an option Due to unusual rain and thunder Baby, I wonder Baby, I wonder, would you just put your sweats on, put your sweats on for me? Yeah, yeah. I got the plug, I made the call for me. Mm -hmm. I'm talking late night for ya. Let me lay a great time on ya. Don't hesitate, no, don't you? Mm -hmm. Just say you will, will. Hey y'all, so it's the next day and I'm on my way to run errands. I'm gonna go to Target. I need to get like 
two, three items out of there. And also, I'm going to see if they have any, like, cute little throw-on outfits up in there as well. You know, Target be having the pieces for the girls. And then, I'm going to go to the laundromat because I need to wash my rug, my rugs, and my comforters. So, that's the move for this morning. Going to the laundry may be pretty pretty cool, but I like washing in my apartment or whatever, but my washing and dryer that's in the apartment is not big enough to wash your comforters, so. And I need my comforters to be real clean, not halfway, so yeah. Sucks, but I'll talk to y'all in a second. You want a special experience? Go to Am I really that much to handle? Breaking these things down like a demo. You don't really just blow you up like a can. Can I really just blow you up like a can? You're a man. You say you was a man. You say you about it. You say you got a plan. I really was trying to listen. You say ain't got no discipline. I'm like, I think you can handle me I'm like, I think you can handle me Oh, nigga, keep your hands on me You wanna stay with me, but nigga, you just a fan Cuff your bitch, nigga, cuff your bitch Watch you slipping in it, nigga, hit a leg on you Really telling me that I could break you down like a gym slip Fuckin' that catch me if you like I'll be seven, you say to I desire Act me like you gay, you can't don't desire I be tryna know anything, I be so excited Fuck it, you can catch me in the hills Watch me close to love, I'm a bitch All I ask for you to keep it real All I ask for you to keep it real, real Hey y'all, so it is later on in the day And earlier I had just made me some breakfast I chilled, I didn't go to work But yesterday was my first day going back to work And that's why I didn't go today Because my body was hurting so bad I don't know, like I'm just tired of driving that fucking bus that's just what it is that's just that's it that's all i'm not even gonna keep going on and on but yeah so i didn't go today because i woke up and my body was hurting really really bad my back was killing me but um anyway i'm about to cook me some dinner for me and my boo and i'm gonna talk to y'all while i'm cooking i'm only about to fry some chicken make some um white rice and some corn and then i got some croissants as well but i want to put y'all up on this um drink if i didn't i think i did before but i'm not too for sure so i put it in a glass so i could be a little fancy because they come up in this a six pack And it only has 5.8% of alcohol. It just give you a buzz, but I like it. But yeah, I had to pour it in here because um, I'm a lady. Okay. So yeah, we're about to cook and do a little chit chat. So I cleaned the chicken already. I'm about to just wipe it off and talk to y'all so one second It is 11 o'clock at night. 
And this man got me cooking. Well, I offered to cook them some because we have been dating for four months since December. I haven't cooked them nothing. We always went out, literally. But, yeah. Since you know I know how to do a look something, why not show my appreciation? Because I really appreciate him, like, seriously. So, I thought I'd make him a little quick little meal. Now, remind y'all, I told y'all I'm not Chef Boy RD. But we're going to get four. And it's going to be good. So, that's what I'm doing. So, I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Let me get this stuff together. Hey y'all, so it's the next day and I'm sitting in my car on my lunch break eating my Lunchable. So, yesterday the food turned out good. He liked it. I enjoyed his company. It was very nice. Or whatever. Then I had to come to work today. <laughs> but good thing that I'm off tomorrow. I think I want to go and have some Cajun boil and have me some drinks. Y'all already know I gotta have a drink anytime I go out to eat. So that's pretty much my plans. I really got a taste for some. Popeye's chicken so bad but let me tell y'all the restaurants over here by my job is nasty and I'm tired of wasting my money on nasty ass food so this gonna do but anyway I'll talk to y'all tomorrow yeah so it's the next day and we're on our way to the nail shop I have an 11 o'clock appointment two of my nails is missing where well, I took them off because they broke in half. So I'm about to get a soak off and I think I want to do like a French tip for my nails and then a French tip for my toes. So soak off, overlay, and pedicure. That is the mood. It started raining here in Chicago, unfortunately. But later on today, we're supposed to either go to Cajun Boil or Papa Do's. But either way it go, I just know I want food and liquor. Please do not forget the liquor. Yeah. That's what I look forward to up on my off days. Because working for CTA is starting to stress me out more and more every day. And I'm tired of these people. From the passengers to the supervisors to the managers. Everybody be having me fucked up and everybody be have to get their ass checked. I don't play around. I play a lot of games, but I don't play about me. Fuck. So I gotta get up out of there before I lose my um my man up in there. But anyway, I just pulled up to the nail shop and I'll talk to y'all when I get out. Hey y'all, so I'm done at the nail shop. 
everything is super cute i'm gonna show y'all when i get home but i wasn't able to record much of nothing because i had to get the acrylic soaked off of my nails and i had her just put some fake nails on top of my nails and cut my real nails all the way down because my real nails is thin right now and i ain't want to do no another set of acrylic being on top of them but we're not going out. My friend want to stay his butt at work and do some overtime. And I know you're going to see this vlog with your little lame is. So, I don't want to go and sit by myself. So, I'm about to go towards the city and go get some Italian beef from this restaurant called Pete's. And I want my mom to try it. So, I'm going to get her one as well. And then I'm going to drop it off to her. I probably sit over there for a little while and then I'm gonna go home and chill in my house. That's it. That's the mood, unfortunately. So I'm gonna talk to y'all in a second. We're heading west to go meet up with my fave so we can have drinks and food. This is the same person, my same friend that didn't want to come out y'all the other day when I had a taste for the Cajun bull. Now he want to come out today, but we about to have a good time because I'm outside for a little time, not a long time because you girl got to work tomorrow and I'm going to work because I need my coins. So I'll talk to y'all in a minute. What you got to say to this my part, YouTube? This perfect time. Everything yeah, perfect time so that we on time. Literally 8.30 at night purpose. <laughs> yeah, he fucked yeah. up. <laughs> he a drunk. <laughs> So I just got home. I didn't do an outfit of the night. So my head scarf is from Louis Vuitton. Shoes is Louis Vuitton. Bag is Louis Vuitton. Shirt Zara. Jeans Zara. Sweater is Fashion Over. And I also just want to talk to y'all really fast before I go to bed. I want to thank y'all so much for me getting to 100 subscribers. I know for a lot of people, that's not really much. But for me to just start off, I feel like it's enough for me personally. But I know my channel is going to grow. I just have to be more consistent 
And yeah, I just want to thank y'all for subscribing. And I know I didn't do like a proper introduction of like telling who I am. So I am Quita. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next vlog. Have a good night.